actual conversation. Hey there, everyone. Thanks for joining us here on CBS News. I'm Lilia Luciano. Here is a look at the top stories we're following this minute. Torrential rain and strong winds bring flooding and road closures to millions of people up and down the East Coast. U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin visits Israel as the U.S. continues to press for a plan to scale back the intensity of the war against Hamas in Gaza. And one of the nation's most popular airlines agrees to a massive settlement for the holiday meltdown that you might remember left thousands of travelers stranded last year around this time. Later this hour, a rare week before Christmas session for the Senate as the upper chamber tries to hammer out a complex deal tying border security to more funding for Ukraine. And then we'll look at the human cost of fentanyl. We'll break down the alarming numbers, numbers from Los Angeles County where fentanyl now takes more lives than any other drug. And as I mentioned, a powerful coastal storm is bringing heavy rain and strong winds across portions of the Northeast today. Torrential downpours pummeled parts of New York, Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and more. The storm caused flooding and travel delays all across the region, with hundreds of thousands of people stretching from Virginia to Maine having lost power. CBS News senior weather producer David Parkinson joins us now right here on Studio 57. David, so what is the latest on these weather conditions? It looks very dynamic and active over there. Yeah, it's very dynamic and active, but it's a whole lot less dynamic and active than it was this morning. I mean, I don't know if you could sleep I last night, it. but it was really coming down. And 